Welcome to the first look at Amazons, the first hero pack for Total War Saga Troy, which will allow players to take control of the legendary tribe. The Amazon factions bring with them unique units and mechanics that will spice up the game for both new and veteran players. It will also be free for any Total War Access members that connect their Access and Epic Game Store accounts and claim the DLC before October 8th. The subject of many legends, the Amazons have often been featured in pop culture and is the namesake of the South American rainforest. A Total War Saga Troy takes a look at the various myths and attempts to answer the question of what was the actual truth behind them. After the sacking of their capital Themyscira and the death of their queen at the hands of the Athenians, the Amazons split into two factions led by two of the Amazons' greatest warriors. The followers of Penthesilea roam the land looking for glory and vengeance, while her older sister Hippolyta wants to secure a new home for her people. This search led her to the coast of the Aegean. In the goddess-blessed lands of Anthea, Queen Hippolyta carves out the future of her people. The Amazon's unique units will assist us in creating a stable queendom for our people to thrive in. Hippolyta's Chosen will rain down a hail of arrows, while the Adromachoian Initiates will hold down the line. Our Amazon Chargers will take care of the flanking, while our horse women chase down the enemy ranged units. Queen Hippolyta starts with a regiment of cavalry, and through their mechanics, the Amazons can get access to more, even without holding land where centaurs roam. The Amazons hold a stringent warrior's tradition amongst their people, and so losing even a single unit in battle can prove devastating to their faction, more so than any other. Only the weakest base units are available for recruitment among the Amazons. To gain access to more advanced warriors, we will need to train up our troops and initiate them into more powerful units. Before we can do that, we need to get training grounds up that will allow for the training. Make it count! So, we lost our horsewomen right off the bat. It will take us many turns until we can upgrade our buildings to get access to the initiation rites we need to replace them. Not good. The settlement we just captured contains Amazon treasures. This is a unique resource for Hippolyta, which will start accruing as long as we hold this settlement. Let's skip ahead a few turns to check out another unique mechanic which uses these treasures. Now that we've gathered some Amazon treasures, let's take a look at the Amazon Kingdom. The Amazon Kingdom is a collection of various mechanics that are unlocked as you progress in the game. This first one will be great for leveling up our armies as it allows us to spend Amazon treasures to give our units extra ranks. Since we need rank 4 to initiate our base units, we'll want to get them there as soon as possible. Military buildings are another great way to quickly get those ranks up as they give plus 1 recruit rank to their respective units. We've now secured a bit of land by taking it from our initial enemies, and we've spent some time recuperating our losses. The devastation of Themyscira haunts Hippolyta's dreams, the shame of that day burning hot. This shame turns to resolve as Hippolyta sets out to conquer the region of Kestros for her people. Candalos holds a decent army, and he has the garrison to back him up. Winning this siege would be tough, so I think we'll wait him out. So Candlos wants a fight, eh? We'll give him a fight to remember, one that will make him rue the day he stepped up to the daughter of Ares. We'll position our medium-weight Amazon swordswomen in the open, but hide our light Amazon chargers in these forests. When the enemy army approaches, we'll sneak through their ranks and attack them from behind while driving the ranged units back. Armies are still mostly comprised of basic units and will be until we can upgrade Ianthia to a level 3 settlement. We need an edge in battle. Let's build a winemaker so that we can get some spy action up in this game. Let's see who among these fine spies will serve the Amazon Queen. Nellius here looks like a good choice. He has a trait that increases his chance for success to spy actions. 
we're going to have Nellius run around ahead of our troops and poison the wells of enemy armies. This will cause them a fair amount of damage, which should make our future battles easier. As long as Nellius can do his job at least. As the Pollock leveled up, we also picked up the skill Drill Expert. This should help speed up the rank ups for any new troops because it starts them at rank 1 immediately. In the future, I'm looking to specialize this into missile units, which will cause our missile units to start off at rank 2. Losing units will be less devastating to our progress from now on. Ianthia has now been upgraded to the third level and we have constructed an initiation shrine and the sacred woodland. These will give us access to the initiation rites we'll need to start upgrading our forces. If we want to gain access to horsewomen or chariots, we'll need to construct war horse fields, but this will do for now. These initiation rites will allow us to upgrade our units anywhere on the map, even in enemy territory, which gives us the freedom to build our military buildings wherever we want. This gives the Amazons great freedom in expansion and gathering resources. Let's upgrade our Amazon swordswomen to Adromachoi, our Amazon archers to Hippolytus Chosen, and this unit of Amazon chargers to Black Spears. We don't have the resources to upgrade our entire army, but this is a good start. It's important to remember that once upgraded, the unit will lose all the ranks and start over at rank zero. Our epic missions have given us a doozy of a task. We need to take the province of Tethrania, which is currently held by Hector. The Amazons have been on good terms with the Trojan princess so far, but this will need to change. To achieve a Homeric victory, we need to finish off all our epic missions. Hector must fall. Warriors have been routed. <laughs>